Introducing Breastlight Enlightened Awareness, the amazing new well-being product that actually allows you to see inside your breast by shining a safe, powerful light through the breast tissue, giving a translucent effect which can help you notice any possible changes in your breast over time. This class one medical device can help you familiarize yourself with your breast, giving you more confidence and peace of mind. Hello, I'm Glenda Mackay and today we're looking at a new and innovative way to actually look inside your own breast tissue in a completely safe and effective way. The breast light is a British invention and it may give you peace of mind and help you to become more aware of what your breast tissue should look like. Today I have Leva Nation in the studio with me. She is a breast care nurse and she was also instrumental in developing the first breast light. Hi Leva. Hi. What is the breast light? Breast light is just an extra tool for self-awareness. It can be used by both men and women. It gives you the chance to see inside your breasts as well as examining the outside. It doesn't replace mammograms or ultrasounds or going to see a doctor if you have a problem, but it's just an extra confidence in, in knowing your own body. It gives you peace of, peace mind. of mind. Yes. And how does it work? It's very simple. It's a handheld object. It's rechargeable. Uh, the first time when you buy a breast light, it's uh, charge it for about 10, 12 hours just to give it a really good boost. And then like a mobile phone, you just need to charge it once in a blue moon. Uh, so it, the charger fits in there. When you turn it on, it comes up with a display. At the bottom there are two numbers. That just tells you how long it is since you last actually used the breast light. So you might think, oh I checked my breasts out last month. When you look down it says it's 70 odd days since you last <laughs> checked it. You ought to do something about it. And the number doesn't actually go off until it's been in use for a minute. Oh wow, that's So a you great. can't cheat, you can't just sort of say, oh turn it on and switch it off again. Yeah, you can't cheat the system. No. Uh, it just shows you how fully charged your battery is. And then the third switch is just an intensity switch. Okay. It works in conjunction with this button. So oh, That's interesting. So why do you need that? Depending on the density of somebody's breast, you need more or less light. Too much light and all you see is a, a, an, an orb, a bright red orb. Too little, you don't see the definition of it. So if I just demonstrate this, it on yeah. my hands, this is on the lowest setting. If I bring it down, you can start to see blood vessels. If I turn up the intensity, that's the maximum. Ah, yeah, you, so can, you can really see, see a you difference. See the complete difference. So, so what would happen if it was really, really bright? Would that help? No, if it's too bright like that, you can't see anything. All you're seeing is the redness. So you want to find the level for you. It sounds complicated, but just using it for once or twice, you'll easily find out that's the level I can see. Thing. Its main thing is to relax with it and just work out what's best for you. Yeah, I would be concerned and say, well, should I be on two or should I be on three? But what you're saying to me is that you would know You would know you yourself. Were. So yeah. what would you see? How does it work? The idea behind it is just three LED lights. Yes. And the LED the lights, they're coloured red to pick up the haemoglobin in the blood. Oh, right. So when you use this, you'll actually see your blood vessels inside. And the idea behind it is if something is turning nasty, um, it, it starts off as a small area, a few, a few cells that will change, but they need to be fed. The body has to send extra blood supply. So it'll send lots of little tiny blood vessels. It's called angiogenesis. And so instead of just seeing your blood vessels, you'll see an area of the breast that is darker, that you can't get the light through. Um, it could be something completely innocent. It could be a bruise. It could be a blood-filled cyst. So don't think, oh my gosh, I found something. Panic. The main thing is you found something it just needs to be investigated. A lot of people, particularly young women, they'll pick up a toddler or a bag of shopping, you knock your breast, you don't actually realise you've knocked it. And you might not even you see a bruise. You won't see a bruise on the outside. So if you suddenly something, see something big, don't panic, it will be a bruise. Um, but it just means that if you see something and you're used to doing it, it gives you the confidence to go to your GP and say, this wasn't there before, can I just have it checked out? Mm -hmm. People that have fibrous breasts, cystic breasts, um, they, they, particularly just before a period, the breasts get more painful, more uncomfortable and they'll think, I've seen my doctor before, I've been told there's nothing there. It's still hurting or it's hurting again. By looking through, if the light shines through because fibrous tissue, cystic breasts, they don't have an extra blood supply, it's mm. no, no more, the light will bounce through it. 
Obviously, if you've got any worries, you still see a doctor the way you would have done before, but it just it's a reassurance that you get to know yourself. What happens if you can see something but you can't feel, feel a lump? You still go and see a doctor because you can't always feel lumps. Mm. And what happens if you can feel a lump but you can't see anything with the breast light? Is that the if, Yes, uh, you would worry about it, and the best thing is just to go and see somebody. Anything at all you're worried about. Skin texture changes, nipples suddenly going in that they haven't done before. Mm -hmm. uh, again, lots of people have inverted nipples, that's them. But if it, any changes whatsoever you should okay, see somebody you yes. okay when you order your breast light you get this um, very nice looking box uh, what is inside it what, what, what do you get with your um, obviously with your it comes light? with the breast light and it comes with the, the charger it also comes with an instruction leaflet which is oh. very 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 explicit actually a little tube of lubricant the lubricant is used just to to uh, aid the breast light to to smoothly go over your skin it right. doesn't actually you don't need it for contact it is purely just to allow the, the breast light to, to, to glide over your breast easier and it comes with a, D, a dvd so it's step by step you can go through it you don't have to think do I, what do, what have i missed you can just go through the dvd and, and this will and actually it. show you a, a yes. demonstration yes. of how to do it talking of which we we should see how you do yes you certainly can, can you show us <laughs> it's very simple Sit in a nice, comfortable area, looking in a mirror, also looking down at yourself. Switch your breast light on. If you've used it previously, you know what setting you want the density on. Failing that, just set it off on the lowest, so, um, uh, the lowest gauge mm -hmm. and gradually bring it up, depending on how much you can see. Yes. Place it under the breast, looking down and also looking in a mirror. It will light up your breast. As the breast light gets in contact, the light comes on. And you will see you when will you see. can see the detail that you need. Exactly. To, yeah. You'll see your blood vessels. You'll yeah. see all sorts of things that you don't know you've got inside yourself. <laughs> and then you just gradually move it round, working all the way round in towards the nipple. Make sure you go right out underneath the axilla. You have breast tissue that goes right the way across the chest wall. It also goes up towards the, the clavicle. Right. It's breast tissue is like a tear. So if you just go through the whole area, always in towards the nipple, mm -hmm. Double backing if you find something that you, you want to have a second look at. Swapping hands, turning it around. There's no, nothing complicated in how to use it. It's just getting used to the feel of how to be comfortable with it. And just do the whole breast like that. When you can feel everything is all right, swap and do the other side. Yeah, I, th I think if I were using it for the first time, I might feel a little bit nervous about getting it all right. What, what would you say to anyone who felt... The first worried? time anybody uses it, it's, why am I doing this? I, I wish I wasn't doing it. Mm -hmm. And then once they start, it's, oh my goodness, is that really what I'm like inside? And that's it. You can't get the, the, the breast light back from somebody. They spend so long trying to do it. Because it's quite fascinating. It's fascinating, <laughs> yes. Well, I think it's a fantastic product. And if you want to find out how to order your own, this is how to go about it. Ordering breast light couldn't be easier. Simply visit our website where you can purchase through our online store. Or if you prefer, you can call our customer service team, who will be happy to take your order. Postage and packaging in the UK is free. Press light is also available at selected pharmacies throughout the UK. Breast light is really easy to use. For women like myself who don't have regular access to mammograms, it's important to know what your breasts look like and feel like normally for yourself. With breast light, the instructions were really simple and I found it really helpful. When I first used breast light, I was amazed at how much detail I could see within my breasts. Um, I know the disease has affected so many people um, and anything that could um, shed a bit of light on any possible problems has to be a benefit. Hello and welcome back. Today we're talking about a fantastic British invention which is brand new called the breast light. It actually enables you to look inside your own breast tissue in an effective and safe way. Joining me in the studio is Lever Nation who is a breast care nurse and she was instrumental in the development of the first breast light. Um, can you tell us a little bit more about it? Can we recap what is breast light? Breast light is just a handheld form of torch using LED lights that enables you to see the inside of your breast so you can get to know the inside as well as the outside of your breast. And how, how does it work? It's very simple, it's rechargeable, just like a mobile phone. You switch it on, it tells you how many days since the last time you used it. 
it has battery um, level so you know it's fully charged and just a, a density light. So can we just recap what the, what the different densities mean? The density, depending on the size and the density of your breasts, how, how thick your breasts are, you need more or less light. It's a question of getting used to what is normal for you because your breasts are different to mine, mm -hmm. to everybody else's. Yeah. It's finding what suits you. And too, how will you know what, what you're looking for? Too much light and it just bounces through and you, you get this red orb. Uh, too little light and you can't see the density, you can't see the blood vessels inside. It's picking up on the haemoglobin in the blood and it's looking for any areas that you haven't seen before. So obviously the more times you use it on a monthly, you know, six weekly uh, uh, way, basis, it basis uh, you get used to it and it empowers you to sort of say, that's how I look, I'm perfectly happy with that. This time it looks a little bit different. I'm going to go and see my doctor and feel confident to go and see them and say, I check myself regularly. It wasn't like this last time. Right. And how exactly do you use it on your body? You'd use it in a darkened room, sitting or standing in front of a mirror. Uh, get yourself nice and warm and comfortable. Switch the breast light on to, if you've used it before, you know which density yes. you want. Failing that, just play around with it till you feel happy. Place it underneath your breast, gradually moving the breast light all the way around the breast out underneath the armpit, towards the axilla, up to the top, so you go up towards your clavicle, right up. bringing it down towards your nipple. Just do it very, very slowly, exploring your breasts, getting used to doing it. And if you do it that way, you'll see as deep as you can possibly feel inside your breast tissue. And if you're slightly worried about, well, that looks very complicated, there is inside the pack a DVD demonstration Correct. of how to step use by step. the breast light. So who is the breast light aimed at? The breast light is aimed at both men and women. About 3% of breast problems actually happen to men. Uh, to start using the breast light from an early age, don't really recommend it for teenagers, only insofar as their breast tissue is changing rapidly. Mm -hmm. So it, it takes time to get to know your breasts. But from 20 onwards, if you start to use breast light, you get to know your own body from an early age so it doesn't become anything you're scared about. You, you eventually end up using it like a toothbrush. It's just second nature to do it. So it empowers you to feel confident about what you're seeing in your breast, get to know your own breast. If you have a problem, you go to your doctor. Um, it just is a great well-being product. Absolutely. Thank you for coming to share it you're with welcome. us today. If you want to know how to order your own breast light, here come the details. Ordering breast light couldn't be easier. Simply visit our website where you can purchase through our online store or if you prefer, you can call our customer service team, who will be happy to take your order. Postage and packaging in the UK is free. Press Light is also available at selected pharmacies throughout the UK.